Ever wondered how some people seem to effortlessly manage their money, always staying in control of their finances? It's a question that has piqued the curiosity of many, time and time again across centuries and continents. Is it some inherent ability they possess? Or perhaps, is it a unique blend of wisdom and intuition that guides them in making the right financial decisions? It's intriguing to see how they seem to glide through life, navigating every financial storm with relative ease. Interestingly, they might not be financial experts or prodigies. They might not hold degrees in finance or have a stockpile of wealth. Their secret might seem mundane at first glance, but its mastery is what separates them from the rest. Understanding money's ebbs and flows. Yes, it's as simple and as complex as that. They understand the intricate dance between income and expenses, knowing when to save, when to spend, and most crucially, how to balance the two. They've mastered the rhythm of their financial heartbeat, understanding its ups and downs, its pace and pause. They are not just aware of the money they earn and spend, but are in sync with the rhythm of their financial life. So the secret to financial well-being isn't shrouded in mystery. It's not magic and it's not luck. It's all about understanding income and expenses, and that's precisely what we'll dive into today. First off, it's crucial to differentiate between fixed and variable expenses. Fixed expenses essentially are the costs that don't change as you progress through different months. They are those stubborn bills that you have to pay month after month, regardless of your spending habits. They include, but not limited to, your rent or mortgage. No matter how much or little you use your place, that cost stays the same. Another example is your insurance payments. Whether you have life insurance, health insurance, or car insurance, these are usually fixed amounts that you have to pay regularly. These types of payments are something that you have no control over, and you need to pay them regardless of your financial circumstances. Likewise, your gym membership that you signed up for with the hope of getting fit. If you procrastinate and not use this service, the fee is still there waiting for you every month. You can't escape that cost. These costs are constant, predictable, and therefore are easy to budget and plan for. On the other hand, we have variable expenses. These are the costs that change with time, depending on how you decide to live your life. These could be costs that are as basic as your grocery bills, that can fluctuate depending diet and the number of people you're feeding. Then there are fuel costs, that can vary vastly based on how often you drive, the type of car you have, and even the current market price of fuel. Additionally, dining out and entertainment expenses are other costs that can change dramatically based on your choices. You might decide to treat yourself to a fancy dinner one month, or choose to stay in and save some money the next. These expenses are a reflection of your lifestyle and are trickier to predict. They tend to change based on your lifestyle and choices, which makes them a bit trickier to predict. Now, let's talk about income. Income, in its simplest terms, is any monetary gain that you acquire. This could be from your primary job, where you work full-time or part-time. The paycheck you receive at the end of the month is a form of income. It could also be from a side hustle, a hobby or a skill that you use to make some extra cash. For instance, if you're good at baking, selling cakes and cookies could be an additional source of income for you. Income could also come from investments you've made. These investments could range from buying and selling stocks in the stock market, purchasing real estate properties or any other form of investment that yields a monetary return. Then there's passive income, which requires minimal effort, such as royalties from a book you published or renting out a property you own. For some lucky individuals, it could even be from a trust fund if you're fortunate enough to have one. Trust funds are essentially a fund composed of various assets intended to provide benefits to an individual or organization. Remember, it's crucial to recognize and identify all your sources of income. This step is vital in understanding your overall financial situation. By knowing where your money comes from, you can plan better, make informed decisions, and shape your financial future more effectively. And remember, no source of income is too small to count. So how do you bring it all together? This is a question that often crosses our minds. The answer you'll find is rooted in a seemingly simple action, tracking your expenses. It might sound like a tedious task, but it is an essential one. There are infinite ways to do this, and the method you choose is crucial to making the process less daunting. You could go old school with a good old-fashioned pen and paper. There's something about writing things down that makes them seem more tangible, more real. It allows you to physically see your expenses, a reminder of where your money is going. 
You could have a notebook dedicated to this purpose, jotting down each penny spent as and when it happens. Alternatively, technology offers us an array of sophisticated digital apps designed specifically this purpose. These apps are often user-friendly and come with features that make it easy for you to categorize your expenses. They can even provide insightful graphs and charts so you can visually assess your spending habits. However, it's always important to remember that the key is to find a system works for you. You might be someone who enjoys the simplicity of pen and paper, or you might prefer the convenience of a digital app. The choice is entirely personal. What's important is that once find a method that suits you, you stick with it. Consistency is vital. Record every expense, no matter how small. Over time, even the smallest expenses can accumulate into a substantial amount. It's the little things that tend to add up over time. In summary, understanding your income and expenses is the foundation of effective budgeting. Distinguishing between fixed and variable expenses allows you to predict your monthly outgoings better, while identifying your income sources gives you a clear picture of your financial inflow. And finally, tracking your expenses provides you with the tools to manage your money wisely. So there you have it. This isn't some secret knowledge reserved for financial wizards. It's simple, practical information that anyone can use to take control of their financial future. Remember, the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. So take that step today. Start understanding your income and expenses and watch as your financial situation begins to improve. And that's it for today's episode on understanding income and expenses. Stay tuned for the next part of Basic Budgeting for Beginners, where we'll delve into the exciting world of savings and investments. Until then, keep tracking those expenses and remember, every penny counts.